um, there there are frequently times when what we want to do is to sell a product we sell it at a fixed price and then we offer a payment plan so here we have one where we sell product for 39.97 and then we have uh, a nine payment uh, payment plan 477.44 we charge a little bit more kind of like as a finance charge and um, this is pretty straightforward using standard Infusionsoft tactics uh, we create one product uh, we create a payment plan that allows you to pay it over nine payments and uh, that takes care of itself but there are times when what you want to do is to charge uh, a higher upfront payment so instead of making it for uh, 77.44 even nine payments we want to take two payments up front and then spread the the remaining payments over eight months so we want to front load the payments and you can't do this um, you know just using the uh, standard uh, Infusionsoft subscription or the standard Infusionsoft payment plans. So here's a tutorial on how to set this up. So uh, what I've done, and I'll go back here, let me get out of here, is I've created an order form and I've created a set of products. Let me get back here so you can see exactly which products I've created. So uh, this, uh, I'll do a quick search here so that we can see only the products that are related to what we're gonna be talking about. Uh, this product right here is the one we use for this page. So this one's pretty straightforward. I'm not gonna go over that one. Um, here's the products. So what I've done is I've created these two products. There's an initial product. That's the one that shows us this one. And then there's a second product that we use to show this payment plan on the shopping cart. It doesn't add an amount because we've added a 30 day free trial at the front of it that delays the payment for 30 days so that we're only hitting them up at the beginning for this amount. Uh, so in order to do this, uh, I'm gonna go through how this is set up and how we use a promotion code or a promotion plan uh, in order to, uh, to implement this. So. Um, we'll quickly go over the initial deposit is exactly what you would expect. This is just a simple product uh, with a set price so that uh, we can add this at the, uh, you know, as the first product on, on an order form. Uh, then we create this one here, with it, which is eight monthly payments of $425. And um, this one is a subscription only product. And it goes in here, so it's eight payments of $425. Again, that by itself is pretty straightforward. But if I don't create uh, an upsell promotion, uh, I'm sorry, a free subscription promotion in Infusionsoft, this first $425 payment is going to be made at the time of the purchase, and we want to hold that off for 30 days. So in order to do this, what I have to do, first of all, is put both of these products into an order form. Uh, this is the order form that corresponds with this uh, right here. And what I've done is I've created an order form that has both products in it, um, $897 to $425, and that's how we get this layout. The way I get this to become a zero and I get the payment not to be initiated for 30 days is I create a promotion. So let me go over, I think I have this open somewhere. No, I don't. So I'm going to go to e-commerce setup and I'm going to go over here to promo codes. It's not really a promo code, it's a promotion. Um, oh, that's the wrong one. I need to go back to just promotions, not to the promo codes. So it's, it's this one, not the promo. So I'm going to promotions and I've created this one here. And when I click into this, you'll see that what I've done is I've, cr I've created a promotion of type subscription free trial. And the way you do that when you add it is you go over here and you add a promotion of this type right here. So if you pick one of the other ones, it won't work. You need to pick this one, which gives you the option of adding a delay so uh, what you're doing is you fill this out you select the product the product I'm selecting here um, and it's in this drop down here which unfortunately rolls off the screen but it is the product that has the uh, there it is 
well anyway I won't touch that one but if uh, if we could see way down here where the product opens up you'll see that it's the product that has the eight monthly payments assigned to it we add a 30-day free trial and nothing else that's all we need to do we save it and that gets put in place so now when I go into this order form and I try to do a preview it comes up it um, puts both of these items in the shopping cart although technically this is an order form and it pushes a delay in here so now I can fill this out I only have to pay this initial amount and the order will be created uh, with with this delay um, so that's how you can uh, change your payment plan make them a little bit more flexible with a, a higher front load and then still be able to charge a subscription uh, over several months to get the balance uh, of your product take care